Welcome to this video where I'm going to talk you through how to set up your Casio smartwatch. This is the GBDH1000 model. Um, how to sync it up with your phone. Uh, now the benefit of this is that all the configurations that appear on this watch um, that you can set and access here, uh, you can do the same thing on your phone. And you may find that using the app is a quicker and simpler method um, to change the settings on your watch. Uh, rather than you know, fiddle around with the menus on here. Um, we'll look at the menus later on, but let's have a quick setup of how uh, how we get through this. So, I'm going to be using an Android device. If you've got an iPhone, you might want to check out an alternative video, although setup is very similar. So the first thing we're going to do is go to the Play Store, and you're going to want to look for the Move app. Okay, second one here. <clears throat> uh, this is the G-Shock Move, I'm going to install it and uh, then open it up. Now obviously you're going to go through a number of different uh, settings. Um, your smartphone will have access to your contacts and also your messaging system. That way um, when you get an alert it will be sent over to the, to the watch. Uh, for now I'm going to pick Deny, Deny, Deny. Okay, now the next thing you need to do is select your region. So I'm in the UK, confirm settings. Then you need to set up a Casio ID. So for this, you'll need to head over to the Casio website and uh, set up a uh, Casio ID. Um, I'm not gonna walk you through this because it's fairly simple. If you haven't got one, obviously you can, uh, you can set it up. It will try and sign you up, put in your details, sign in and then it will take you back to the um, to the page. So you wanna make sure that your Bluetooth is on on your device, um, and then obviously make sure the Bluetooth is on here, and then it will uh, find it automatically, and um, you can check this by uh, loading up the app, and at the top it will give you a little connection sign once it is connected or, or synced together. If not, we can go into the settings, hold it down, scroll up, looking for uh, airplane mode, just make sure that's off, yep. And then we are going into pairing, and we're obviously gonna pair with this one here. Make sure my Bluetooth's on, yes it is. Now, sometimes you need the location on, so make sure that's on. Pair again. And you can see it says it is connected. And it's already uh, sent a notification through. Okay, so you can pop your uh, location off and you're sorted.